Hi guys, my name is Anton. I'm happy to see you today. Did you know that sending your cover letter to a company increases your chances to get the job? If your answer is no, this lesson is what you need. Today we will learn how to write a cover letter for the job you want to receive. Some useful phrases will help you to do it successfully. Writing a cover letter is not an easy task even for the greatest professionals. It takes time to learn how to write a unique and catchy cover letter which will make the HR managers notice you. So let's take a look at what a good cover letter looks like and analyze it. There is a text on the screen. Pause the video and read the text or follow me reading it. While reading, try to guess whether this cover letter is good to get a job or not. Dear Mr. Andrews, I'm a young and energetic professional with three years of experience working as a project manager in a cultural sphere looking for an opportunity to apply my skills in different ways. I'd love to bring my expertise and enthusiasm to your growing company. Let me draw your attention to two reasons why I would be a great addition to your team. First, I have worked on a diverse range of cross-cultural projects. My experience of working consists of 12 successful projects, including film production, the School of Arts, theatre performances and many others. My time at Creative States Company has equipped me with strong management skills. I showed significantly great results in making reports to project sponsors. Around 100% of my financial reports were accepted from the first try and with positive feedback. My role specifically involved working with artists and clients, so I'm aware of how to communicate with my team and participants of the project and to conduct teamwork. Second, I'm a perfect fundraiser. During three years of my career, I've managed to raise around $30,000 for educational and cultural events and projects. Moreover, three films made by my team won the highest award at the Venice International Film Festival. However, I don't feel like an overachiever. There are plenty of goals and ambitions I want to reach. I would really like to try myself as a project manager of music festivals and cultural open spaces and this is one of the reasons why I want to apply my skills specifically in your company. Finally, I'm confident that my range of skills combined with my motivation and experience have given me the skills necessary to work as a manager of your projects. I would value the opportunity to show how to increase the profit of your company by 30% within a year. Thanks for your consideration. I'm looking forward to hearing from you. Respectfully, Alexander Austin. So, dear students, do you think this cover letter is good enough to get a job? Hope your answer is yes. Now, let's practice a little. There is a task on the screen. Pause the video, read the statements and choose true, false or not given. Are you done? Let's check. 1. Alexander is a manager with 3 years of experience and 13 successful projects. False. He is a manager with 3 years of experience and 12 successful projects. 2. Alexander has excellent report making skills. True. 3. Alexander raised $30,000 from foreign sponsors. Not given. 4. The boy proposed to the hiring manager to increase the company's profit by 30%. True. Excellent. Let's move on. And now, after we read a good cover letter example, let's learn what makes it good and how to write it by yourself. So, to write a good cover letter, you need to follow the following structure. First, you have to write your contact information and date. Contact information includes your name, address, phone number and email address. And of course, you need to greet the person who will read the letter. Remember, it is always better to write letters personally, so try to find out the name of the person who will read the letter. Second, write a short opening of two, three sentences. Start strong. Tell why you are interested in the position and what you can propose to the company. You may shortly describe your experience and background in one or two sentences. Third, write no more than three paragraphs of the main body. You can shortly describe your relevant skills to the position, share your achievements and future ambitions and express your enthusiasm for working in the company. Fourth, write a strong closing. In this part, you may promise something that will interest the recruiter and thank the reader for consideration. Lastly, write a valediction. Use a professional sign-off like sincerely or best regards and don't forget to write your name and surname at the end. There are some phrases which will help you to write a cover letter. To start the letter, you may use the following phrases. Dear Miss, 
Mr. Dear hiring manager. Dear sir. Madam. In the opening, you can use these phrases. I am a young who has recently graduated from looking for an opportunity too. This position strongly resonates with my interest and work experience, especially. Let me draw your attention to two reasons why I would be a great addition to your team. First. Second. In the main body, I suggest you use the following phrases. My role specifically involved. I'm confident in my ability too. My time at has equipped me with strong skills. I have worked with a diverse range of. In the closing, you should use these phrases. I'm confident that, combined with, have given me the skills necessary to work as. I would welcome the opportunity to meet with you to discuss. Finally, in the valediction, you should use these phrases. Best regards, kind regards, best wishes, respectfully, sincerely. It's time to practice. There is a task on the screen. Pause the video, choose the correct option. Ready? Let's check. 1. A. I'm confident that my personal values and experience combined with my education, have given me the skills necessary to work as a manager. 2. We promise something interesting to a recruiter in the section of C. Closing. 3. We share our ambitions in the section of B. Main body. 4. A. My role specifically involved providing customer service to top clients. 5. You shortly tell why you are interested in a position in this section of B. Opening. Well done. Hope it wasn't too hard for you. But in case it was, please revise the information in the lesson and practice more. I feel we had a really productive lesson. During eight minutes, we have learned a lot of new functional phrases, learned how to write a cover letter and analyzed an example of a good cover letter. Please don't forget to check your extra materials after the lesson. Think of a job you'd like to get in summer, make some small research in companies that are interesting to you and write a cover letter to this company. Thank you for watching and have a nice day. Goodbye.